and here we are. Welcome to Season 2 of the Castle GTX Cup Series. And this is the new race for the season, the Bud Shootout for the poll winners for the, or should we say the po returning poll winners for the 2000, or for the Season 1. On the poll, Ryan Cooper alongside of him, Alexander Dawson, Row 2, Dalton Day, and Adam Chambers, Row 3, Trey Campbell, and Dylan Poteet, the defending Season 1 champion. Dylan Hughes and Matthew Rodriguez is row four and row five. Dougie Shears and Aaron Reed. And here we go. This is an eight lap race. The Bud Shootout is underway. And here we go. And boogity, boogity, boogity. Ryan Cooper gets a good start, and here they come on the break in the turn number one. Ten cars in this field, and it is Ryan Cooper out in front. Cooper takes the lead on here. Alexander Dawson in the second position. Third is Dalton Day. Are trying to take the second position now as they come down the back stretch for the first time here in season two. Takes them a while to get these restrictor plate motors all the way wound up as they come down to the third and fourth turns now. Ryan Cooper still has a top spot. Out of turn four, here they come, and Ryan Cooper leads lap number one. Dalton Day goes into second position. Third is Trey Campbell. With a new car this year, number this season number 14. There they come there. Dylan Hughes in the fourth position. Dougie Shears in the 48 this year, or this season, is in the fifth spot. Here comes Dalton Day to the inside. He's got help from Trey Campbell down the backstretch, and Dalton Day has the preferred grip on the inside. You, know, you get on the high side, you're screwed pretty much. And that's what Ryan Cooper did. So gets caught up high. Dalton Day takes the top spot now. Working lap number two laps completed here. Six to go. Back in the turn number one. Dougie Shears now goes into third position. There he's got help from the 78 of Aaron Reed. And Aaron goes to the inside of Dougie Shears. They come down the back stretch. Trey Campbell making a move to the inside, the 14 car. And he's got the help from the 78 of Aaron Reed. Aaron Reed in the 78, he's in behind Trey Campbell. Adam Chambers is there to four. And here they come to the line. Trey Campbell leads that lap. Back in the turn number one, they come. Down the back stretch, here comes Aaron Reed. He's he's gonna try to make the move to the inside. Yes, he will. He's got the inside lane working for him in his favor. Adam Chambers shutting him in the four car. Remember the last time the race at Daytona at night was the Pepsi 400. Adam Chambers won that race. And here comes Adam to the inside. Aaron Reed leads that lap, but it's when they get back in the turn number one, it's gonna be Adam Chambers out front, maybe. Yes, it is. Adam Chambers has the nose out front. Dylan Hughes in the second position. He is in there helping Chambers. But for how long? Here comes Dylan Hughes at the inside. Nope. Thinks better of it. Sticks, his, sticks back in behind Chambers. And here comes the three car of Matthew Rodriguez. Coming down to the line, it is still Adam Chambers out in front, Dylan Hughes. In the second position, Matthew Rodriguez in third with the help of Dylan Poteet in the fourth spot. On board with Matthew Rodriguez in the three car. Matthew Rodriguez is 
on board camera is Dylan Hughes. Takes the top spot. And that's what it was like for Dylan Hughes' car. This is what the driver wants to see. Nothing. Now for the roof cam of his car. That's what it's like at 195 miles an hour plus. Down the back stretch they come. Dylan Hughes leads, but when you get down the back stretch, it's going to be Dylan Petit making the inside. The, the season one champion. And he's got his teat, and he's got Brian Cooper shoving him down the back stretch they come. Or actually going to the third and fourth turns. And coming on this time by, it will be. The white flag, one more to go, and who's gonna win the Bud Shootout here at Daytona? Here comes Ryan Cooper on the inside. Everybody's getting into it here in this final lap. He's got Dougie Shears helping him in the 48 car. And it's Ryan Cooper to the top spot. Does Dougie Shears or any of them in the back have anything for the number one car? Ryan Cooper went winless in season one. Trying to close the deal here at the Bud Shootout. He's been second a few times. Here they come. Last sprint out of turn number four. Dougie Shear stays tucked behind. He's making no action to try to take the lead. And to the line, Ryan Cooper has won the Bud Shootout here at Daytona. Second to Dougie Shears. Third to Adam Day. Or excuse me, Dalton Day. Adam Day's one of my friends, by the way. <laughs> and there's the results. Ryan Cooper, the winner. Dougie Shears finishes second. Third to Dalton Day. Fourth to Trey Campbell. Fifth to Aaron Reed. Sixth, Dylan Poteet. Seventh, Matthew Rodriguez. Eighth, Dylan Hughes. Ninth, uh, Alexander Dawson. And Adam Chambers brings up the rear in 10th position in his 10th. Car bud shootout average speed 195 miles per hour. And there it is, your bud shootout champion. Ryan Cooper has done it. So that's it for the bud shootout. Next race is the Daytona 500. And season two is about to get underway.